Good morning world from Mount Shasta. So this is Siskiyou Lake, one of my most favorite lakes in the world. Look at this view. <laughs> and I have to say that you can get all caught up in whatever it is you're doing and forget where you are. So be here now. All of those gurus and saints are right. Being in the now moment takes practice. But I have to say I was not practicing this morning when I was feeling pissed off about something. And so the answer coming back to the present moment, isn't it incredible that we have this beautiful world to be in? But we oftentimes forget <laughs> Coming up on a gorgeous view here. I can't even believe how beautiful this is. Mount Shasta in all her glory. On an alpine lake. Oh my god. I never even knew about this view until this morning. And here I was bitching and moaning <laughs> in my little cave world before getting outside. And here was what was waiting. Plant yourself in a divine location and don't forget how amazing life is. I am just completely blown away. Mount Shasta. Mystical, magnetic otherworldly and as we can see some early morning fishermen <laughs> that looks pretty fun maybe they need some crew it looks like they're getting some fish they actually caught something So I am just laughing at myself because I was crabby. <laughs> and you know what the antidote to crabbiness is? It's nature. And that is really why I live in astoundingly gorgeous places. Because there's absolutely no way you can stay in a bad mood when you open your door to the sunshine and let it shine into your soul. When you're in a mystical, beautiful place, there's just no way to um, stay crabby. <laughs> so that's my advice for the day. Nature will cure anything. Have a beautiful day.